Hi, I'm Hazel. Today, I've got a guide on how to get the three alpaca mounts of 8.3, the spring fur alpaca, the elusive quick hoof, and molly. First up, the spring fur alpaca comes from the friendly alpaca in Oldham. Step one is to collect Gersol greens. You'll need seven in total, but just one's fine to get started. The greens spawn through here, along the riverbank in Oldham, and they look like this. If you have herbalism, you'll see them on your minimap, but you don't have to have herb to gather them. They're pretty easy to find, so I'd just stock up once and then keep them on you. Next, you'll need to find the friendly alpaca. It'll spawn in one of these spots around Oldham. It only stays for about 5 minutes or so once it's up, but the respawn is pretty quick at 5 to 10 minutes. Keep an eye on the group finder for raids that have found it or are searching for the friendly alpaca. A group can just park people on every spawn point and then call out when and where it spawns. Once you've found the alpaca, complete its daily quest by feeding it some greens. You can do this once per day and you need to do it 7 times to get them out. Don't worry about skipping days, that's fine. It's 7 times total, not necessarily in a row. To track your progress, you can type this script into your chat log and press enter. I'll put it in the description in case you want to copy paste. It'll print out a counter of how many times that you fed the alpaca so you know when to get excited. Next up is the elusive quick hoof. This one also involves finding and feeding a rare alpaca with a few important differences. One, this alpaca eats seaside leafy greens. It does not require organic hand harvested farm to table produce. You can get these off a vendor. Alliance can buy them from Scrollmaster Euro here in Boralus above the island expedition vendors. Horde can get them from Keto over here in Dizarlor. There's also like a dozen more vendors that have them as well as your friendly neighborhood Brutosaurs. Difference 2. This one spawns in Vuldoon, and it can patrol around some. The NPC name is Elusive Quick Hoof, so pop that into a targeting macro and spam away. These are the known locations. It reportedly has a much longer spawn time of 6-ish hours, so you may be in for a wait. And 3. The good news is that you only need to find it once. Feed it one singular seaside leafy greens and it's yours. While camping, I once again recommend either waiting in a group so that you can park people on each spawn point, or at least keep an eye on the group finder for the kind souls that have found it. Our final alpaca mount is Molly. This one will be either by far the easiest or hardest one to get, depending purely on how lucky you are. Molly has a chance to drop off of Dune Gorger Crowlock, the Vuldoon world boss. The BFA world bosses are on a 6 week rotation, so you get one chance per 120 character every 6 weeks. We don't know what the drop rate is exactly yet, but reports are estimating it in the ballpark of 1%. The best thing that you can do is kill him whenever he's up on as many 120 alts as you can. I got quite lucky and got it on my 10th try. If you're not doing anything else with a 120 alt, you could even leave it out there in Vuldoon to save on travel time. And those are the 3 alpaca mounts of 8.3. You might be in for a farm, but the mount special makes all of this worth it. And if that didn't sell you, have you seen its back legs when it jumps? It's ridiculous. Thanks for watching, share your camping anecdotes below, and have a wonderful, wonderful day.